I'm an identical twin and my brother has a bigger dick than you? But then you wouldn't be identical. Like, wait. So I thought if you're an identical twin, the only thing that's different is the stuff that you, like maybe one twin is more like nourished than the other one. So then that twin would grow more, right? That makes sense to me. Why would your dick get smaller than the other twin? Like, what did you do? Maybe he went on one of those porn sites and bought one of those things that makes your dick bigger or something. There's the RNG as humans grow. So you got, you got bad dick RNG, that sucks. Sorry, dude. I'm never, ever, 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 ever gonna do that strat again for the rest of my fucking life. I'm never, ever jumping off that wall again, okay? Never. I hit that thing like 80% of the time. I hate that invisible wall so much. I got high on gas fumes and I sucked my brother's dick. Wow. That's cool. There was a girl that was like, that messaged me like a month ago. I don't think I told you guys this story. She was like, let me see that 6'4 body. I'm like, okay, so the camera's gonna make it look like I'm not 6'4. Just run that out there. <laughs> but okay, did she believe the pictures? But, you know, probably not, but whatever. Now, we need to be really good and stop losing time. Now, now, okay, this needs to go. Let's fucking go. This has to do it. This has to be it. Oh my god, what the fuck? She's pumped. I like how I have a good sleepy stream, except for the fact that around 6 a.m. my dog is gonna bark you awake. This runs over. Thanks for two truth. Hey Clint, big fan of your Margarita since if you consider running a Zelda game. Nope. Never. Maybe Minish Cap. Google blue waffle? All right, if you don't like blueberry waffles, like, I don't know, you probably, I don't, they're good. It's literally the nickname for infected vaginas. Wait, seriously? I thought it was just shorthand for like, blueberry. Whoa, dude. <laughs> I should be an actor. You're too ugly to be an actor? Yeah, but there's like ugly actors out there. I don't have to be like the attractive guy. I can just be like the ugly dude, that's fine. I could just eat a lot and become like the funny fat guy. They always need a fat guy. <laughs> You're too ugly to play the ugly dude. Wow, damn. Uh-oh. No way. No way. We're gonna... No! <laughs> Alright, I apologize. I apologize, guys. I heard Steve Jobs got... isn't actually dead. He gets cryogenically frozen under Disney World. Have you heard, the, heard about that story? Oh wait, that's Walt Disney. You're right. Sorry. Yeah, that's my bad. You came from Twitch fails. If you watch me from those things, you would think that I fuck up all the time, but it's actually not true. So you might be disappointed. How much you pay for a pill that prevents you from choking? I'd probably choke on the pill that prevents you from choking. I really don't choke that much. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. I don't watch any TV. I watched Breaking Bad on YouTube. I watched like 30 minutes of clips of Breaking Bad. I know what happens in the show. I know what happens to Gus, Hank, Mike. Ruin for yourself? I was never gonna watch it, man. Like the only ending clip I could find was where Walter wakes up and he's like the dad from Malcolm in the Middle. Like there were so many clips I watched that were like all fucked up because people think their editing is so funny. They're like, wow. Like there was a clip that I thought was legit where uh, Hank is watching a video on the TV and it's like the thread video. And it's a video of like Hank and like some BDSM like advertisement. I'm still confused as to why the BDSM advertisement exists because I didn't watch the whole show. <laughs> I leave for army boot camp tomorrow. Give me advice. Um, you're gonna wanna not tell anybody that you're gay. All right, don't do that. They'll probably kick your ass. Actually, I don't know if army, does army do that? Are they like super, 
I don't remember. Just be careful. If you are gay, just try to find somebody who's like also gay and then fuck each other or whatever. Oh shit. You know what? Let's just... What life achievement would make you say to yourself, I can die peacefully now? If I had a bunch of children and they were wildly successful and I was like a good parent, I'd be like, all right. Good parent, you would sleep through a fire. <laughs> Please don't breed. I'm gonna breed, man. You can't stop me. I'll name my son Brento. <laughs> do you want your kids to get bullied? No, my kids are gonna do the bullying. They're not gonna be nerds. Hansel, he's gonna steal your lunch money. <laughs> your kid's gonna end up like that ginger who complained about ginger bullying. My kids aren't gonna be ginger, unless I marry some with red hair, because it's like recessive. I mean, it is a little unfair, okay? If you were like, damn, I hate Italians. People would be like, wow, that's racist, dude. Or like, damn, I hate my... I'm not even gonna say it because you're just gonna record it and take it out of context. You'd be like, damn, that's bad. If you're like, damn, I hate gingers, people are gonna be like, yeah. Like, how is that fair? It's not fair at all. I was called the carrot ghost in high school because I'm a ginger. Feels bad, man. Dude, I feel you, bro. I feel you, you shouldn't have to deal with that. <laughs> I don't want to ever work for anybody ever again. We pay your salary, you little shit. You're not my boss. You don't, like, you know, I don't show up to stream when you guys are like, wow, you're late. You know, I'm gonna fire you or anything. You can't do that. I'm gonna be on time. Alright? I'm gonna be on time, but I'm basically like, I own a bakery, okay? And you guys come in every day, and you buy your little cupcakes every day, and then you say thanks for the cupcake, and then you leave the bakery, all right? I don't know why I painted myself as a cupcake baker, <laughs> but you get the idea. If I don't make the cupcakes, you can just bitch at me for not making cupcakes, but that doesn't mean that I work for you. I just make cupcakes, all right? I know that you guys are confused, but I'm pretty sure that made perfect sense. Oh my god, we can't even get to Womps today. <laughs> These cupcakes suck dick. What about chocolate cupcakes? Yeah, you can get a chocolate cupcake. It's an imaginary scenario. You can get any type of cupcake you want. Oh wait, no, what was my restaurant idea? I wanted a gourmet cereal restaurant, that's right. I wanted a restaurant for dogs, where we sell gourmet dog treats. And you can just hang out there with like the dogs and stuff if you want to. A maid cafe in the USA. That wouldn't be a bad idea. A maid cafe where they sell, what, Chinese food? It'd be like maid hooters. And you can eat the food off the maid's like chest. Yeah, a strip club, basically. <laughs> if anyone has like a business opportunity that they want to like message me about, there was someone who seriously tried to get me to buy a WNBA team with him. I think it's a bad idea. Like, we, if we became like majority owners, we could like rename the team. I could run the team through straw poll, that'd be sick. Now there's some upsides to the WNBA prospect being like a good idea. Gambling is gonna become like a thing in the NBA. If you can gamble in the NBA, you could gamble at WNBA. I bet degenerate gamblers would gamble on the WNBA if they had nothing else to do. Also, if basketball, its popularity is going up and football's popularity is going down. That's a good thing. It should help the WNBA, so that's also good. The, the downside is literally nobody gives a fuck about the WNBA and those teams bleed money. That's the downside. So yeah, there's some risks. But that's also why we could, we could buy a team and get in cheap, you know? We get our WNBA team, we just, we just get a bunch of traps who just like destroy the league. <laughs> The most unstoppable WNBA team of all time. Dunk from like the free throw line. <laughs> Thanks to the find the Deku Cucks. I've got this, bro. I've got this. That's not that big of a deal. We have 30, 35 seconds. That's like a 20 second death. Damn. Yeah, I fucked it up. Run's dead, guys. Oh man, I had such a bad TikTok. Shit. I don't know. It happens. Did I PB? Yes. But I only PB'd by like half a second, so it didn't actually drop my time down. We're gonna try and PB again. If I PB'd every single run, it would be boring. But if I 
edge you over and over again. Oh, the explosive excitement. Dude, I'm like night shift, okay? Oh shit. What? What is happening? There we go. Wow. 